Good evening. I have a question for my audience. How many of you did not pack your lunch today? Well, maybe, yeah, you, don't, you didn't pack it, okay. <laughs> maybe you didn't have time to go buy groceries, or maybe you are those kind of person that only have 20 minutes to go to leave your workplace, go get food, and come back to work. Whatever your case might be, it is lunchtime, and you're definitely hungry. What are you going to do? Are you going to the vending machine? Or are you going to McDonald's again? Come on, no. Well, forget those options, because tonight I am bringing you the solution, and that solution is El Arepaso food truck. And I'm sure you're thinking, wait, food truck, El Arepaso first, what is an arepa? So if you do not know what an arepa is, I'm gonna give you a quick reference. So as Americans have hamburgers, and Mexicans have pupu uh, gorditas, I'm sorry. Uh, Central Americans have pupusas, well, Venezuelans in now Grand Rapids have arepas. My name is Mary Elizabeth Rojas and I am from Venezuela. Uh, my background is in civil engineering. Um, I know about systems and processes and I also know how to solve complex um, problems. But you know what? I am very passionate about my Venezuelan food truck. And I learned from my grandmother and from my mother how to make awesome arepas. And I'm going to share with you my secret in our secret is the love for our family and our culture. My food truck will be located at industrial parks where many employee, employees from manufacturing companies will have the best option of food right outside the workplace. Because this, um, I'm sorry, this um, industrial parks have currently very limited options for food. They just have gas stations, vending machines, and fast food. But we can provide you great food and fast. The arepas, besides being fast foods, they are healthy, they're gluten-free, and they're delicious. So what makes this meal even better is that they are also affordable. I will provide you a complete meal, including a drink, for just $8. To start my food truck, I will need an initial investment of approximately $15,000, which includes the purchase of, a, of an used food truck some kitchen utensils, and raw materials. I will reach my break-even point when my monthly sales are $3,300. Now, let's talk about my marketing strategies. I will be using the distribution of flyers with coupons and information. And I will leverage on Facebook ads to promote my hours and to start building a customer following. Similar to an ice cream truck. So you hear the music and you know that the ice cream truck is around the corner. Well, when you see this dancing arepa, you know el arepaso, it's almost there. I will also upload pictures on Instagram to showcase my product and I will use Instagram to increase visibility and awareness. Thank you very much. <laughs>